Meanwhile, Senate President Tom Tavares Vinson had to rebuke opposition Senator Lambert Brown for comments made during the debate on the extension of the SOEs. Mr. Brown raised the murder of attorney Sasha K. Fairclough in Otoria, St. Anne, and they made reference to a murder of a businessman in Montego Bay, St. James. Mr. President, a businessman in Montego Bay, Mr. Andechin. Senator Brown, yeah. you didn't hear what I'm going to say now. You, you did it once already and I was to talk to you about it. People are going through the most amount of distress. Don't come to the Senate and call it the people in name Mr. and rest and, until you have the Mr. Family President, family. You agree unless you can show me the standing order, which I can't do it. No, sometimes these senses is not in the standing order. No, enough. President, you know the problem? When Andrew Ones, when Andrew Ones talked about crime, there was no decency issue there. No, so when I talk saying. about it, you talk about decency? No, what I'm saying, you call up the lady, the lawyer name that was But she killed. died. Yes, I know. You the tell whole of Jamaica know, but you think the family So why then is a problem if I call it some more? Hear, hear what Mr. I'm President, ruling. I mean, hear my ruling You're on going this to Muslim, right. No, I'm not. Yes, okay, I'm going to Muslim. In an instance like this, where a family has, has um, experienced the most horrific um, circumstance. I myself cannot imagine it. You come to the Senate and I throw people name all about and I bring it up in an argument about state emergency. Allow the family to grieve. Allow the people of Jamaica to recognize the terrible state that these people must be in. Don't take it and throw it around the Senate. I know you'll call up somebody else's name. I heard it when I was outside. Don't do it, man. No, Mr. And President. I'm not saying it. Look here now. It is not in the standing orders. What I'm appealing to you. Alone allowed, the no. Allow the people them to grieve and, and come to terms with, it, with the situation, man. Now, even after that speech, Mr. Brown went on to talk about the issue forcing another intervention from the Senate President. Low it, no man. Just move no, on to something else. You're parading the people's distress in front of the nation more than it is already parading. So that the conscience of the Jamaica Labour Party may be affected to do the right thing and come with a comprehensive crime plan. Is. That is why I'm putting it in the, there. It is, when you it take is. a six-month-old baby that is killed, what do you mean there again? A six-month-old baby murdered. In the middle of a state of emergency, and you tell me we're saving lives, that, exactly? that the state of emergency is working, right? Senator Brown, yes. you know, you know, I don't, I, I kind of appeal to you, you know, I appeal to you in terms of, in, in terms of good sense and decency. That's how I appeal to you, and you ignore it, and you say you're going to talk anywhere, you're going to talk according to the standing orders. Well in relation to the standing orders of this Senate, and it refers specifically to the issue of questions. However, it can be as extended, I am informed. A question shall not include names of persons. This is not a question. Not a I question. am not suggesting that it is a question. Yeah, what I am suggesting no, 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 to you, no, no, no. well, listen, let me tell you something. No, it is my ruling no, but it that you move on and stop creating greater distress for the people who have suffered most dastardly um, in, in this instance. Move on, man. President, that is my ruling.